Hello everyone and welcome to Neat Mentor. In the series of branch wise specific videos, today we are going to discuss about MS ENT branch. In this video, we will cover almost everything which is required you from your side to know about MS ENT. So what you may need like uh, last year government uh, cut off for government colleges, state wise for both the state quota as well as all India 50% quota. State wise bond and stipend details. Then we'll cover the state wise DNP cutoff and the state wise stipend range and how many hospitals were there last year for the DNP ENT. Private college cutoff, state wise, including open and closed states, is yearly fee range and stipend range. Then deemed universities. All the deemed institutes cut off for MS ENT is fee structure and monthly stipend. Then mass versus rank mapping for the last year, so that you can get an idea in uh, your expected score how much rank you are expecting and what options would be available for you in case of ENT. In the rank range of forty-five to seventy thousand and seventy thousand to just qualifying. What are the different options for you to go uh, for the confirmed seat in MS ENT and budget? Top 30 government colleges for ENT and top 30 DNB institutes. Okay, so these are all details in a single video. So that makes uh, this video very special in case you're looking for MS ENT. And if you want such videos for other branches, we already have posted it. You can uh, browse through our channel and you can get it. In case you want to avail our paid counseling guidance, these are the packages and the details available on neatmentor.co.in. You can Google it, Neat Mentor, you will find the website. You can purchase the package from there or you can call us. You can also join our Telegram group. Link is available in the description of the video. You can purchase ebooks also. Uh, State wise, All India Quota, Deemed University, DNB Diploma, separate ebooks. And you can get access to our portal where we have the complete counseling details and data for last two years 2022 and 23 you want any cutoff for any college in any quota it will be available there is fee details and uh, clinical details uh, like uh, branch wise details in different institutes how many surgeries getting conducted all such things so if we talk about how to get seat in ms ENT in the government college so there are just two ways, ways to get it all India quota 50% and other ways to get through the uh, get the seat in MS ENT is uh, through state quota counseling and the state wise cutoff is given here for example in Delhi it was 4706 through all India quota counseling and there is no boundary in Delhi the stipend on average is around 1.20 1.20 lakhs which is maximum among all the colleges in India. In Andhra Pradesh, for the government college cutoff was 19,405 and through state quota, it is 18,020. It means you go through All India Counseling, you will get benefit. But in case you have some category also uh, applicable there for you, like BC A to BC E, then you should target your state quota, you can get benefit. This cutoff is for general category. In the state of Assam, also, a state quota has benefit over all India quota. So there are two types of states you can classify. Uh, and you should know like the state you come from or where you have the state quota benefit, whether it's low merit state or high merit state. So in case of low merit, you will get uh, better seats in comparison with all India quota counseling. Okay in the same state and uh, through all India counseling you can get seat in anywhere in India uh, because 50 percent seats from all the government institutes are covered in MCC and 100 percent seats in central universities okay talking about DNB so the DNB cutoff is uh, lower comparison with MS ENT and uh, why because many private institutes but the tuition fee you have to pay is same 
1.25 lakhs yearly and uh, in the same tuition fee the the institutes will provide the hostel facility also so the cost of uh, education is very low and is equivalent to government college but the but the getting into this uh, uh, entry to ms e dnv nt is easier than government but the difficult part is the final year exit test okay in the exit test you might not uh, clear the exit test in the first attempt it is possible and it all depends on where you have completed your uh, dnp course how good uh, was the fashion floor and uh, did you get hands on opportunity academics how it was and all factors okay so you must uh, be selecting any dnb institute very wisely okay so you don't need to repent later you must need the review and for all such things you can contact us we have the paid guidance for that here the state wise cut off is given so in case you have a list of a states which are preferred for you you can get to know whether you can get dnb in your score where uh, expected score this is the private college cut off for the last year so when i say the private college cut off it is the last closing rank among all the colleges available in that state for example in state of bihar okay there are colleges like mata gujri devi katihar medical college narayana sasaram lord buddha okay so among all the colleges and how much is the tuition fee the tuition fee range because all the colleges might not have the same tuition fee for a particular branch so in bihar the tuition fee for ent is very low 10 to 11 lakhs and uh, some colleges are very good and stipend is so very handsome if you just uh, take a look at stipend if they are giving you just uh, 70000 on average okay because it's incremental year wise so it's coming down to 12 into 7 around uh, 8.5 lakhs okay so you are able to complete the education for free almost so that's benefit in katihar the stipend is 90000 or more than that okay so you have to just pay the hostel charges so that that is very peculiar option okay when you don't have the budget still you can take loan and you can uh, pay the next two years uh, tuition fee from your stipend okay and the cut off was 53597 so stipend and tuition fee early plays a big role in the cut off where the cut off is high it doesn't mean that the college will be very good or the top college it means there are factors on which it depends how the cut off trends going for the particular college if the fee is low the cut off will be higher some of the private colleges uh, you find it better than government institutes and dnb institutes why because it has better fashion load it's old institutes it has good academics and it has good uh, equipments okay all the modern equipments and complex uh, cases are coming into that it has super specialty and all such things so you need to consider private if you have the budget and if you want to consider these are the details based on which chances of getting seat in ent in just mediocre budget up to 20 lakhs per year is so very high even you just qualify okay and this is the cut of four deemed universities so few deemed universities are very very good okay and uh, is much better than the government institutes also most of the government institutes i would i would saying because there is no uh, there is no drawback in terms of patient load it has a huge patient load at the same time top uh, professors uh, academics very good and uh, you are getting hands on also at the same time the equipment that you are looking for okay uh, depending on the branches are modern okay all the facilities hostel facility everything is good so if you want to go for the top colleges you must consider deemed also some of the deemed like uh, kasturba manipal mangalore amrita sri ramachandra gss keli velgavi all such institute dy patil pune okay and the cut off for the last year is given the cut off is on the lower side is all due to the fee structure it doesn't mean that these are the not the good colleges 
ओके एंड इन केस योर रैंक इज बिटवीन फोर्टी फाइव टू सेवेंटी थाउजेंड देन इन ऑर्डर टू गेट कन्फर्म सीट इन एम एस सी एन टी विच आर द ऑप्शन यू शुड कंसिडर यू वोट गेट सीट इन गवर्नमेंट यू वोट गेट सीट इन डी डी एन बी इंस्टीट्यूट आई एम टॉकिंग फॉर जनरल कैटेगरी कैंडिडेट देन यू हैव टू टारगेट एट डीम्ड यूनिवर्सिटीज और प्राइवेट कॉलेजेज एमंग द प्राइवेट कॉलेजेज इफ यू कम फ्रॉम डोमिसाइल स्टेट वेयर लो बजट प्राइवेट कॉलेज यू कंसिडर दैट else you consider open states open states like himachal pradesh you can consider bihar rajasthan madhy pradesh telangana haryana karnataka pondicherry uh, tamil nadu west bengal uttarakhand uttar pradesh if rank is further low and you are just qualifying then you should consider like rajasthan then pondicherry karnataka west bengal Uh, you can consider deemed universities and top deemed universities in our quota also if you have proper nri documentation uttar pradesh is always a good option in low score for any branch because many colleges and uh, the college are not up to the mark and these are the top 30 institutes okay and um, mam si vardhwan mahavir medical college and saptajang hospital seth gs lokman tilak and sain hospital rml delhi UCS MS, UCMS, uh, Government Medical College, Calicut, Stanley Medical College, Chennai, and this is the top uh, 30 DNB institutes. If your rank is very good and you are reluctant to get a good uh, DNB hospital, then you can fill the choices accordingly. Sri Ganga Ram, Tamil Nadu, Kovai Medical College, Coimbatore Medical Center, uh, Esther Medical City. गवर्नमेंट मल्टी स्पेशलिटी हॉस्पिटल चंडीगढ़ नाराना हरद्वालय हॉस्पिटल इन बैंगलोर डी टी यू भावा एटोमिक रिसर्च ओके सेंट स्टीफन्स बी पी एच बेंगलोर बैप्टिस्ट हॉस्पिटल एंड ऑल सच ओके यू कैन फाइंड द लिस्ट हैव सो दैट्स ऑल फ्रॉम माई साइड वी हैव कवर ऑलमोस्ट एवरी थिंग एंड rather than telling you each and everything here you can take a screenshot and you can do analysis on your own if you want our help you can call us and you can get our paid services so thanks for watching have a nice day